I just, I don't even know how to comprehend exactly what I'm doing in this game. All right, well, here's a beacon. Let me set a waypoint. What in the world? So there's an outpost over there. Um, I mean, we kind of have to go to an outpost, right? It's going to take us 12 minutes if we try to get there on foot. So let's, we'll take the ship and we'll get there. So we only have 50% launch thrusters. All right, let's go. No, we don't need to pulse jump. We're not that far away from it. This is crazy. Oh, oh, wait, there's something down there, too. There was another outpost down there. Look at all this. It's crazy. Okay. We're here. What do you want? I assume there's a radio signal, so that means somebody is sending the signal. Oh, 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 armadillo creatures, what are you? A Hekoanoi Aguinos. They're fearful. How do I rename you? I want to rename you. Unless somebody already renamed it. I don't, I don't know. This is the Geki Swamp. Um, hello. Oh, you're a person. Hi. How's it going? Broker Enk. A lone creature awaits me. Diminutive, beaked, unthreatening. It regards me with passing curiosity. Chatters briefly in a language I cannot comprehend, then passes me a slate. With a start, I realize that I can understand the text on it. In disbelief, I try to catch the creature's eye, but it has already turned away in disinterest. I suspect it is a mere courier, not the author of this message. The slate also contains a blueprint for a new technology. A hyperdrive. Of course we're going to take that. Instructions on how to build my own path through the stars. This will be invaluable. All right, so it's just waiting for me to leave, okay? So we need a dynamic resonator and more heridium. So I have some on the ship. Um, can I go out through this door? Yes, I can. What is this? Uh, this is a bypass ship required. Oh, I can actually call my starship here. That's pretty cool. All right, let's get some more stuff here. Oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, what is that? Excuse me? Look at all this stuff. A Mongonica Amethos. I'm scanning this rock, Hezoite. I just don't understand this. I don't understand any of this. Oh, what is that? And we also have a space station coordinate up there. Oh, it's up there. Yeah, that is way, way off. So we're going to need to go to a uh, space station at some point. Okay, let's just transfer some stuff to the ship, okay? Let's do that. So this is another save point. Very good. Um, whoa, 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 what are you doing, buddy? No, not that. I'm trying to analyze that thing, whatever that thing is. Nope, not that. I'm trying to analyze whatever that thing is. What in the world? Return to your starship. Oh, so I have to just go back to my ship, and then I have to go back up to the space station. Yeah, journey milestone accomplished. There we go. Let's, um, let's get some carbon on our way out of here. 
So we got some of that. Let's just get in the ship and get out of here. Oh, there's birds. Do you see the birds? I am definitely going to analyze you. How do I analyze you? All right. Well, we're just going to go. We're going to leave the planet. We're going to head up to the space station. And I mean, I only have like one more launch thruster thing. So, all right, let's go and go. Wait, where the hell is it? It's like way, way off. All right, let's do the uh, pulse. Oh, wait. I can't use my pulse engine when I'm in the atmosphere? All right, let's leave the atmosphere then. All right, there we go. We left the atmosphere. All right, now where is this space station? It's right there. Okay. Oh, wait. I can feel the gravity affecting my spaceship. Let's go engage the pulse! Uh, it can't take much more! Oh my god, this thing was far away. How can I even detect it? It's like super, super far away. Alright, we're almost there, we're almost there, we're almost there, we're almost there! Oh! Oh, oh, thank God it shuts it off on me. That's good. Okay. So we're just gonna smoothly coast into the space station. Well, listen to this music. All right, let's go. All right, and it automatically lands me, good. Very good. Okay. Let's get out. I guess I just take the stairs? I expected, like, teleporters. Okay. We'll head up to the door. Oh. Oh, look at this little area. This is nice and cozy. Site 81Z... Dash three. Terminal boot sequence. So I can sell stuff. Oh, oh, oh. So this is almost like, um, it kind of like keeps up with what you've discovered and what you've done. So let's buy items. So what we need is a dynamic resonator. And I still can't, I can't buy any. Right? Oh, wait, I can't. That's what I thought. Oh my god, I only have 1,200 units. So I need to sell stuff. Okay. Understandable. Um, I don't really want to sell my charm if I don't have to, but... Or my fascination bead. Okay, so Aronium... It's a lightweight and highly malleable alloy in high demand on the galactic trade network due to its utility in the construction of planet-side outposts and facilities. So seemingly, I can actually sell this. So let me sell it. Um, combined neutral alloy that uses... Okay, so yeah, so we can actually sell that as well. Very cool, so we're up to 5,000, but I'm still nowhere near what I actually need. Damn, so it looks like I'm going to need to go to a lot of planets. Well, I might as well sell the copper, because I have no use for the copper yet, and we're actually getting a good deal on it in this space station. We'll also sell the iron from the ship, because keep in mind, this is all from the ship. Um, the other stuff I feel like I need. I need to sell more stuff, but unfortunately, I really don't have a lot more stuff to sell. So what I actually have to do is head down to the planet. Oh god, don't land on me. I have to head down to that planet nearby and we'll go get more stuff. All right, so before we take off, let's go to our our life support system looks good. Our multi-tool could be better. Um so we'll get rid of a little bit of carbon here. And let's get our life support system uh, topped off as well. This little bit here. 
There we go. Okay. Take off. Oh my god. Alright, so we're heading to this planet? Or what planet am I heading towards? I wanted to head towards that other one. Which one kind of looks like Earth? Vextrus XB. Oh, I already discovered that. I was already down there. I already discovered that as well. Oh, this is the big planet. Yeah, that's the big one. Um, is there anything else around us? Oh yeah, here's like the Earth-like planet. Um, yeah, let's go to that one. All right, engage the boost. We're gonna need more to get there quicker. Engage the pulse drive. I'll stop that now. Just kidding, I'll stop it now. Ah, you thought I was gonna do it again, didn't you? So this game, very, very complicated. I really, really enjoy it though. It, it seems like it's gonna be a lot of fun to try to master the universe and just to try to find our way because we don't even know which way to the center of the, the universe yet. I assume once we get the hyperdrive and we can start jumping like from galaxy to galaxy, we'll be able to figure out where the center is a little bit easier. This planet was a lot further away than I thought it was going to be. And we really don't have a lot of fuel left, so we're burning a lot to get here. What happens if you run out of fuel in space? That would be pretty bad if you just run out of fuel. Alright, um, I guess I'm just aiming for this area right here. The gravity is pulling me down. Alright. Pulse engine is off. Oh my god. This place is very, very cold, it looks like. Oh man, we're burning up on entry! Okay, right here. Um... Let's just check out... Oh, oh, what's that over there? Um, I really don't see anything super valuable around here, but we might as well land here. And we'll get out and we'll check this planet. So this is Icebound Planet. It is icy. Sentinels are passive. The flora, there really isn't much flora. Oh wait, now we gotta worry about our temperatures as well. So we'll destroy some of that. What is this? One bypass chip required. So this is a signal scanner. Oh, it looks like we have an outpost over there. How far away is that? Oh, it's shelter. It's five minutes away. Um... Huh. What- or what are you? A Tevalath Utusuru. Um, its temperament is anxious. Yeah, I kind of get that. Hello? Hello, friend. Are you friendly? Oh, don't run away. Don't run away. No, I just want to be your friend. Oh, wait, I can feed it. I need 10 Heridium. Isn't there like one of those rocks? Oh, right here. Here it is. I can feed you guys. Oh man, I just melted a hole right through that. So we just mined as much of that rock as we could. And uh, our inventory's full. So we're gonna go ahead and feed this little guy right here. Hello, I wanna feed it. There you go. Oh, look at that. Oh, he's happy. He's happy, hello. Yeah. Oh, and then you just run away, okay. Oh wait, you're coming back to me. Oh, nope, you're running away. What are you doing? Oh, you just want to be with your family. Here, let me go feed your family, too. You're just a cool little guy, aren't you? Here, come here, I'll feed you. I'll feed you. There you go. Come here, little one, you need some food, too. Here, 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 here. There you go. Alright. You guys have a good day. You be a happy family, okay? Don't trust any other outsiders. Oh, what is that? Oh, what is this? 
Flora, ins interact for protection. Oh, my exosuit temperature rises. Nice. That is awesome. Well, I guess I'm too far away from that. So, interacting with plants is actually beneficial because it allows you to, like, increase your shields and your temperature and stuff. Um, let's get the plutonium back to the ship. And we'll get a little bit more. There we go. What is this? This definitely looks like something. We got some more platinum. Some carbon. Oh! No, I didn't want to hurt you. Oh, okay, you're fine. You just wanted to be near me, didn't you? Well, good for you. You just keep doing your thing, friend. Wait, what's this? What? Why am I interacting with you? What's happening? You have like a... A thing you want me to look at, right? Is it this? Or is it this? Oh, wait. Wait, I can interact with that substance. So let me um, transfer some more plutonium. <gasps> oh my god, you showed me where some chrysonite is. You showed we where more. You are awesome, you know that? I have to I have to get rid of it. Um All right, you go back to the ship. You are very very important. Oh my god, you guys are awesome. I'll feed you for days, friends. Do you want me to look at more? Holy crap, these things are awesome. Right there is something that's aluminum. Oh my goodness. Oh, wait. Another thing? Yes. What's up, my friend? What? What do you want? Oh, more titanium. You are awesome. Well, my friends, I think I have to head out. Good luck on your planet. I gotta head to that shelter to see if there's any living beings here. But I won't forget you. I won't forget you, friends. Goodbye. They are, they are awesome creatures for sure. Too bad I already forgot what they were called. This thing is pretty far away, actually. Okay. And we are here. Initiate the landing sequence. I'm probably going to need... Oh, this is an actual area. Um, there's... Oh, the shelter's right here behind me. A signal booster. I can actually interact with this one? Yes, I can. Oh, no, I still need a bypass chip. How do I build one of those? I, I shouldn't be able to build one of those, but I'm, I'm going to need to go in here first. Read encyclopedia. I've learned the geck word for high. All right, so if, if my character somehow gets high, I can tell them that. A bypass chip. So I can actually build one of these. Okay, so now transfer this to me. So now we can actually go outside and we can use this bypass chip. So what exactly is this going to do? Drop pods from orbiting freighters contain useful alien technology. Scan for their signal and use their contents to upgrade your exosuit. Oh, scan for alien technology, sure. I receive coordinates. Oh, drop pod. Oh. That is way over there. Holy crap, that's way over there. Um, can I actually, like, mark that as a waypoint? Was there anything in here? I got something. Oh, I got an app! No, oh, what did I get? Oh, I got a shielding plate. And what was in this one? A cargo drop. I got a gra-gra. What the fuck are some of these things, man? Alright, well, before we head to the, um, the drop zone over there... There is a cave over there. And it does look pretty gnarly. It actually doesn't even look like a cave. None of this area actually looks like a cave, so... I think what we'll do is we'll get in our ship... 
I need more iron, actually. And then I should be able to craft something else. I just went to go scan the area, and I found, like, all this stuff. Oh, damn it. I'm pretty sure my ship is full, too, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Fuck, so we're not going to be able to examine this. Um, let me actually see if I can charge this with a shielding plate. There we go. And we can charge it with a little bit of carbon. Uh, we can get our, mul our mining beam going. Oh, that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to upgrade my mining beam. Um, and I'm pretty sure I just needed, like, some extra stuff. There's Gecknip. How is my inventory full already? Oh, create that and improvements. There we go, so we can actually build this upgrade. There we go! So now I got a beam focus thing. Yeah, so it changed the color of our beam and it seems like it mines a little bit faster and better. That's good. I like that. What's the bolt caster? Combat focused weapon. User is advised. So we can actually build that. Oh, 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 oh. So I can actually. How do I e equip my focus beam, though? Oh, to swap. Ah, triangle is to swap the modes. Got it. So now I can actually fight stuff. Cool. We need to go find that alien drop-off. And then once we find that, we'll head back to the, um, the space station. Alright, so where was this? No, nope. go back down. And... Oh boy, I'm getting dizzy by doing this. Okay. There. Okay. Let's boost over to the drop pod. This actually isn't as far as I thought. This is kind of going back over right to where uh, I met my friends. Oh yeah. Okay, so now we can actually get another restore point. And this looks pretty damn cool. Suit upgrade. Oh, hell yeah. Install new suit slot. Health, accept. Yeah, of course I'll take it. Why wouldn't I take that? That is very, very cool. And now that we got that, we can save here. And we will be good to go.